Hi, welcome to another session on JMeter. Today's section, I will explain about IP scooping with JMeter. How to simulate requests from different IP addresses. In this image, you can see I have set up, going to set up IP1 and IP2 and IP3 and hitting the our target server that means host URL using the multiple IPs. So for that we need to follow below steps. First step is configure the network. Then there are set up the JMeter script and run the test. So I will configure the network first. So taking the network on control panel go to the network and sharing center you can find the the settings of internet so click on the wi-fi wi-fi so it will pop up the dialog box in that you need to click on properties and need to choose the click on the internet protocol version for tcp bar ipv4 okay then click on properties in that you need to use the use the following ip address so how to find out this ip address for that going to the uh, command line windows key plus r and type the cmd and click enter so in command line need to type ip ip config okay so it will give the ipv4 address for me it is 192.168.0.107 okay and default gateway is 192.168.0.1 okay so i will configure that one 192.168.0.107 that is the first ip and it will it will automatically come populate the subnet mask and default gateway is 192.168.0.1 this need to enter here and the preferred dns 192.168.0.1 okay then click on advanced here you can see one ip is added that is before we added that one again add another ip click on add and enter the ip address 192.168 0 and 108 click on outside it will pop populate the subnet mask okay click on add so two ips we have added one more ip i am going to add click on add same procedure 92 168 0 only increment the last last one 109 okay click on tap and it will the subnet mask will populate and click on add so right now i have added three ips okay 108 109 and 108 okay then then click on ok so our network side setup is completed okay close then we need to go to the jmeter and here i already taken a script which i have already done a video about how to use the http script record how to capture the uh, web uh, capture the record and uh, making the script so i will add that in the description box and i uh, i also add the concurrent third group video in the description box you can check and how to use that and implement this 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 script okay then here i just adding the how to what are the things we need to extra add for the multiple ip migration so for that we need to add the csv config data config for that on test plan right button click add config element csv data set config here we going to 
add a csv file and from csv file the ip different ip address will be coming to the our jmeter script which we, which is we already configured under the network okay so this is the csv file and this is the variable name ip and ip address 168.0.107 and this is second ip and one more ip i have added that is 192.168.0.109 so three different ips are available for our test and the variable name is ip so click on save so in jmeter we use we need to choose the file name so for that browse choose the csv file okay this is the csv file I have saved okay choose the csv file okay which i have edited right now okay so we have choose the csv and the variable name is ip right so for that so drag and drop, drop into for better alignment okay for the view purpose so then the next step is going to our request http request default here we need to go to the here we mentioned the https scheme and host name or go to the advance here we need to change the implementation as http client 4 okay and one more settings is there ip host name here we need to hold the variable that's ip for that dollar symbol raise open and op close within that we need to mention the ip that is the variable name we have mentioned here that one so the same will be here mentioned okay then we additionally same variable name is giving under the request page this is the request page and i am adding that ip for when we running we need to understand which ip is called so i have just called the variable name here so different ips will be appear on result okay so we can understand that one which ip is called for hitting the request using that ip okay so here i using the concurrent third group so you can use normal third group my purpose is to hitting the target with concurrently so first of all i have concurrently hitting by three users in one second okay so three one hold it for one second so in below graph you can see three users hitting under one second okay so you can check you can check what is happened the settings are completed we have configured the network configured the network ips and the script implementation source all are, all are done then we need to run the test okay so for that click on run start button yes and see this is hitting from different three different ips we have configured okay suppose we have adding one more ip here 192.168.0.1010 and save then if i run with the using for thread group then run the test then what will be the result the 1110 will be failed because we not configured that under the network okay so whenever whenever you using a adding a ip in excel you need to configure that in network okay that is same the properties here we need to add the we need to add the ip address here if i added one not one one ten ip address here then it will work okay likely you can perform the multiple ips hitting from the jmeter from using the jmeter 
and also if you're running with the heavy load i recommended that you need to disable this and add add the listener of summary or aggregate this report these listeners are need to use otherwise it will in the view result tree you will use heavy load okay so this is all about today's video hope you enjoy this section and happy testing thank you